So welcome back to another video here on the channel and surprisingly there is some Jeepers Creepers 4 news. Shout out to 3 Seed Films, he actually did a video on this. But yeah, Jeepers Creepers 4 is moving forward with development. I love the first four Jeepers Creepers movies um, and it's sad, you know, that these movies don't get, a, you know, love, you know, they don't get action figures and t-shirts and, you know, the, the, you know, the attention that they need, and that's the fault of Victor Saba, which I, we know, which I will be not getting into. But if you know why he needs to leave this franchise, then you know. But he, this is coming from IMDB. So, basically, IMDB, right? Everybody knows what that is, I'm sure, right? But even though this is coming from here, you still going to have to take it with a grain of salt. I will post some of the stuff right here. Um... But it says the first page was updated on May 8th, 2020, and says the fourth installment has been announced and that, it, that in January, script was finished. We couldn't find the link in the recent announcements. But what IMDb labels and updates as script, it means completed, copywritten, manufactured, which has been picked up by a production entity for development. A script may take the form of screenplay, shooting script, lineup script, community script, or scap script. So here's what I'm showing you guys. Due to current events, production information have been changed without notice, status, updated details. Script, January 8, 2020. Announced May 8, 2020. But more interesting, current, some... IMD Page has him announced as producer of all of his other pre-production projects. Kirk is the head of Murder Pictures, a company which, is, according to them, is leading the independent entertainment company in production. From what we understand, a title can be tagged as announced for years IMDb without any move, but the Creeper... Four announcement was updated on May 8, 2020. This could mean two things. Either it's rolling along or it's going to be marked as such for years to come. James Creepers 4 profiles actor John Jonathan Burke listed as a rumor to return. Burke could play the Creeper in all of the original films. There's something to say really. So basically IMDB um, has listed this as confirmed, but it's obviously not confirmed. So this is interesting, I shall say. Um, do we need a Jabers Creepers 4? No, I tell you what we need, and that's and I preach this time and time again. I want a new Jabers Creepers movie, but I don't see a Jabers Creepers 4 being successful. I see it being the biggest flop in the horror history, and I say that because of Victor Salva. This franchise has not survived because of Victor Salva. I'm not getting into the details, but if you know, you know, and it's really sick what Victor Salva has did and I really I really don't understand how he's still walking right now but point is he um he killed this franchise he killed it you know he killed this franchise he killed his own franchise because of what he did in the past how could you think well I'm going to go to Hollywood and make this movie in you don't think your past, your nasty, sick past is going to creep up on you? Well, it did, and you killed your own franchise. You know, I said this before, we don't need a Jabez Creepers 4. We need a full-blown reboot. New director, new writer, new producers, new everything. The only person to return, I would think, will be the person that plays the Creeper. And I believe his name is Jonathan. Because I can't talk. Because I think I said his name. And yeah, just have Jonathan come back as the Creeper. There's your new movie and just call it Jeepers Creepers and put it into theaters. You know, if theaters get to open, you know, in the next year or two. The point is, you know, I'm very, you know, I want to have a discussion in the comments below with you guys. Do you want a Jeepers Creepers 4 or a full-blown remake? We need a remake. Let's be honest, we need a remake. If you are a fan of these movies, you got to preach for a remake. You know, we need somebody to come in here that's not afraid to take on the Jeepers Creepers title and they can actually put a budget behind it, can put a budget behind it, good, you know, get a good director in there, some good writers, some good effects, 
you know, and just make a good, you know, Jeepers Creepers movie, you know, and just make a really scary Jeepers Creepers movie with the original actor to play the Creeper. That's your movie right there. There's tons of ideals that you could do with the Creeper. You know, he's not like Michael. He's not like Jason. You you know, he, you know, you could do whatever you want with his character. You know, you could take away the spring element. You know, where, like, he feasts every 23 spring, I think. You can take that out and make him more of an urban legend type of character. You know, to make him more threatening. You can do anything you want with the Creeper. But I think that's what we need. We don't need a Jeepers Creepers 4. What we need is a full-blown remake. And I'm thinking about even making a video of what I would do with this franchise. And it's very simple. Rip back, you know, Victor Salva from this franchise. He needs to sell his property immediately. If he cares about this franchise as much as he says he does, then he's the, he needs to sell it because he kills his own. He killed his own franchise. I remember back in the day, Jeepers Creepers 3, you know, you know, just alone, they didn't want to play it in movie theaters. I remember, you know, I believe they was even going to play it at, at um my local theater, but they pulled it last minute because of Victor Salva. Because his name was attached as director. His name alone would not, you know, again, do you blame, you know, theater chains? Do you believe people now, you know, not wanting to associate with him because of what he did and it's really messed up? We need a full-blown remake of this franchise. If you don't get a remake, and I mean this, if a Jeepers Creepers 4 comes out and it's with Victor Salva, I'm not going to go see it. I'm not going to buy it on Blu-ray. I'm not going to support something like that. Because at this point, Jeepers Creepers 3, we was all hyped for, and we kind of thought maybe a new director would get involved or whatever, but we got whatever that was, and it was a flop. So I'm telling you right now, if a Jeepers Creepers 4, if a Jeepers Creepers 4 happens, I it's really hard to say if we should support it because I think I could speak for the whole horror community. We want a remake with a new director. They could put, you know, and again, I know that could be scary. I know that could be scary, you know, taking on a, you know, taking on a franchise that had a controversial director attached to it that did, you know, nasty, sick things, you know, but I think Jabber Scrapers could be a success with the proper director and the proper studio. They could put the budget behind it, you know, you know, you know, bring the Creepers, um, original actor back, raise his salary up, you know, for two more movies, you know, um, you know, um, do that, you know, you know, have a studio that's willing to, you know, put, you know, put promotion and money behind it, you know, a, you know, put a good story behind it, get a good director that's not scared to get in the director's chair and make a good Jeepers Creepers movie that understands the struggles of this, you know, find a company that's not scared of putting out action figures and t-shirts, you know, get a, you know, get, you know, get all of this, you know, done, like, Again, I think it could work. I think a Jeepers Creepers remake will be so successful with the right director, with the right studio, with the right promotion, with the right money, with the right promotion, with the right merchandise. You know, I think Jason has action figures, Chucky has action figures, and they sell and they sell every single day. They sell every single day and they sell out. Like they sell out, and, and it's so random. I was trying to get a um a um Chucky pop vinyl. Like a few days ago, three online stores I searched for was all sold out. So these action figures sell. They make money. We buy these action figures. So t-shirts, all these posters do it. You know, um, again, uh, I don't want a Jeepers Creepers 4. I want a remake. But let me know in the comments below, what do you want Jeepers Creepers 4 or a remake? A remake is only for this franchise to be, you know, to be successful. And yeah, so let me know in the comments below. And, you know, you know, one more thing, I don't see a new director coming in and picking up where Victor Selva left off. Because, again, Jeepers Scripts 4, you know, so. Anyway, leave me a big thumbs up, please subscribe, and don't forget your bell. See you guys in the next video.